Good news, my lovely, wonderful people. This is serious. Ohanyeze's react to Tenubu's certificate saga says it's about time we get to the very bottom of this and get this matter settled once and for all. This is very, very serious. So this is what is happening, my lovely, wonderful people. And um, you all can see for yourself that it is no longer business as usual. Yes, it is no longer business as usual. Everybody's aware, even children in primary school are discussing Bola Ahmed Tinubu's predicament. You know, children that can reason, they're already saying, ah, ah, now, wow, this country, Sha, our president, he did not go to school. You know, saying he did not go to school is not the issue or the problem. It's the lies that has encompassed everything. That's where the real issue is. The lies that is surrounding everything now is the real issue. Is the real issue, you know? So please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe as we really get an understanding of what is going on. We can't continue like this. We just can't continue like this. This is serious. Ohanyeze Zindigbo's react to Tinubu's certificate saga. The Ohanyeze Zindigbo worldwide has called for an investigation into the allegations of the discrepancies on President Bola Ahmed Tinubu's Chicago State University certificate. Already, we see BBC come to tell Nigerians that the certificate presented to INEC was not forged. Just to pipe down what the United States has already told Nigerians, they need a credible media, an international one like the BBC, to tell Nigerians that the Tinubu certificate was not forged. But American report says differently. What, I, what we will want to say is that this matter should be thoroughly investigated. What is preventing the DSS? the National Assembly, and all agencies of checks, making sure things are done properly, carrying out their personal investigation to get to the bottom of this truth. It seems no one wants to know the fact. They just want to carry on with the cover-up. In a statement on Wednesday signed by the Secretary General, Maz Yoke Chuku, the organization said the allegations of forgery and identity theft are serious and must be properly investigated. Don't just leave it to chance. He appealed to Nigerians to remain calm and wait for the outcome of the Supreme Court of the Supreme Court on the ongoing certificate saga and also urge politicians and other stakeholders to refrain from making a statement that could further divide the country. They should carry out their personal investigations. Ohanyez has also said the caution against any attempt to use allegations to cause chaos and instability in the country will not be necessary. All these are simple. The country, the agencies that are responsible for checks should carry a personal private investigation and decide it and know the truth for themselves so that we can know exactly what we are faced with. The statement reads in part, Do Hanyezes in the boss appeal to Nigerians to remain calm, aware of the outcome of the awaiting the outcome of the Supreme Court on the ongoing certificate saga involving President Bola Metinobu. Again, we urge politicians and stakeholders to refrain from heightening tension and overheating the politics of our nation. This must be done quietly, decently, and in order. However, the allegations of the discrepancies on the President Chicago State University from the United States of America is a serious matter. It is beyond just the four walls of Nigeria. International community is involved. We must be careful how we carry on with this matter. Otherwise, Nigeria will not be looked upon favorably and Nigeria will be looked at as a nation where truth has now become nothing. And this will affect the credibility of the nation. Ohanyeze Zindibos, you have spoken very well. How do I applaud you? I like that thing you said. Why can't DSS and all the relevant agencies go ahead and carry out what we call a thorough investigation? Yes. Carry out a thorough investigation. Let's understand what is going on. Do a thorough investigation. Don't just sit down there and tell us that all is well. It doesn't work like that. No way. Carry out a thorough investigation. Go ahead. Look at it. You know, make sure that you dot your eyes, you cross your T's. Of course, if you say it is the country that wants to clarify the identity of the president and want to ascertain who we really have in the arm of affair, I believe 
whoever is necessary, whoever is the person in charge, will give you all the necessary information you need to get. So please, quit deceiving Nigerians and tell us the truth. You know, we need to know the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. You see, so these are some of the things happening, and we want this country, we want everyone, we want those, okay, the DSS, are there, are there no people who carry out checks to, to be sure that the university you said you attended is just a simple email. You don't need to travel to the country. A simple email will do it. Requesting this for this purpose, you know, with a follow-on, a, a phone call follow-up. And guess what? Things will be rather different rather than, you know, leaving things to chance and feeling that, you know, all things bright and beautiful, that's the way it is. And that, no, 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 no. We can't do that. We just can't do that. We are in a place where credibility and honesty must become the watchword. We are in a situation, we are in a state right now where every single person needs to ascertain, you know, who we have. Who do we have around us? Who do we have around us? Who is, our, who is saying is our president? Is he really the president? You know, does he fit the criteria? Has he met the requirements? It's not, it's not, it's not uh, spiting anybody. It's just stating the obvious and making sure that the right thing is done. That's just how it is. That's just the way it goes. It's not anybody trying to, you know, trying to, you know, um, make the other person feel bad and all that. No, 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 no. That's not it. That's not it. You know, so we all must rise up and we must ensure that the right thing is done. You see, so my lovely, wonderful people, what's happening? What are we allowing today to continue to, you know, to, to take over our space? What are we giving that opportunity? What are we, what are we allowing? You know, we must be careful. We must check out all those things thoroughly. We must check them out. We cannot allow, you know, these people. You know, these people to, to continue to decide what happened to us. Many of them don't even, they don't even, don't even want to know the truth. They don't want to know the truth. Okay? They don't want to know the truth. They just want what they have now. Nothing must alter the status quo. You see them very relaxed because they know that um, they've settled things to a large extent. You know, they've settled things in a, in a way that nobody can just come, you know, and, uh, and just alter or touch anything that has to do with them. You know, so these are some of the things happening. Yes, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day. And from us, it's bye for now.